Let's turn now to Abuja, where the Supreme Court has fixed 3rd of October for judgment in a suit filed by Smata DME challenging the conduct of the 14th of April primary election of the All Progressives Congress for the Kogi governorship election. Justice Inyang Okoro fixed the date after a hearing in the appeal uh, which was um, conducted. Uh, judiciary correspondent Celestina Iria reports. Senator Adeyemi is challenging the validity of the election that produced Ahmed Ododo as the APC's flag bearer for the November 11th governorship election. The grounds of the appellant is that the provisions of the Electoral Act and the guidelines of the APC were compromised during the primary election. Specifically, Senator Adeyemi, who until recently represented Kogi West Senatorial District in the Senate, is claiming that the result brought out by the APC in support of Mr. Ododo was fraudulent and invalid on the grounds that the primary election was conducted in only 11 out of 239 wards in the state. A federal high court in Abuja and the Abuja Division of the Court of Appeal had, however, delivered judgment against him on the grounds that the allegation of malpractices were not proven as required by law, prompting him to head to the Supreme Court. At the Supreme Court counsel to Senator Adeyemi after adopting his brief, prayed the APS court to grant the relief sought by his client. The senior lawyer argued that the primary election of April 14th was conducted in gross violation of Section 84 of the Electoral Act 2022. He claimed that the election did not hold in 228 words, and that claim was supported by annex field officers in their report on the primary election. However, the APC put the Supreme Court panel headed by Justice Inyang Gokuru to dismiss Senator Adeyemi's appeal on grounds that it is against the concurrent findings of facts by the trial courts and the Court of Appeal. report of the INEC, SBIT APC 4, said it loud and clear that, that there are no elections to around 28 words. That's our own field. It's our, uh, yes, it's our field. So, but we are waiting for what their lawsuits are going to say. A party in the local, in the, in the rural areas, they are supposed to vote, they are supposed to be accredited. They were not accredited. But the argument now is, was there a valid election conducted? No, because you cannot ask, you cannot tell us that 11 word result eh, is any percentage that is worth saying that somebody emerged through winning in 11 words. What about the result of the 239 words? Although this may appear to be a matter within the APC, which ought to be sorted in-house, the grounds of the appellant is the adherence to the provisions of the Electoral Act. Celestina Iria, TVC News, Abuja.